Sam. And I'm John. And together we are the Coastal Kids. And this is another two minute rock pool safari. Let's, Let's go, go coastal. First rock, three fish. Three fish are all rock brownies. Room's really huge, so we think she might be carrying babies. Let's get this girl back in the water. Check out how many beetling anemones are on this rock. There's so many of them. You can see here the eggs of a nudie branch. There's a really small nudie branch here that probably laid them. Here's some more. These elegant snake locks and anemones always have the most amazing colors. Look at this small collection of cushion stars. Can you see the small one? We found three different types of our native crabs. First is the Xantho crab. You can see why some people call him the furrow crab. You can see his furrowed brow at the front. You can also identify him because of his massive claws. You can see right here. They're too big for his body. Next crab we have is a juvenile brown edible crab. These guys can barely move out of water, but they can really shift when they're in water. Next is the most common of the lot, the shore crab. We've got a female shore crab here, and you can see that she has a bunch of eggs underneath her apron. Let's get this girl back somewhere safe. There's a lot of these strange eggs around here, they are the eggs of a green leaf worm. When you come across green leaf worms, they're really, really long and they also produce a really sticky, slimy substance. And finally, we have an eel-like creature called a butterfish and a really slippery one too. It's almost like they're covered in butter. That was a really amazing rock pool safari and I think you can agree it was a beautiful day for it too. Please remember to like and subscribe and join us on our next Coastal Kids adventure. Bye! Bye.